no! Cupid lost his arrow, and he needs it to spread love on Valentine's Day. What are we going to do? To the top! Hi, everyone! Today, we're going to try to help Cupid find his arrow so he can use it to spread love on Valentine's Day. I stumbled on some vases over here with all of these beautiful Valentine's Day themed colors. Maybe if we look inside, we can find some clues about how to find Cupid's arrow. Come on, let's get started. How many vases do we have here? Let's count. One, two, three, four, five. Five vases. Perfect. Let's get started by finding out what's inside the first vase. What color are the items in this vase? Pink. Yes! Inside we have sparkly pink garland with rainbows. So cool! Let's see here. We have a party backdrop. It's got a polka dot bow on it, and little balloons, and a sweet little door. I also found Pink car. Beep beep. Vroom vroom. Let's see who the pink car will bring. It's Sky. It's a little pink bunny with red sunglasses. It's a little girl wearing a pink dress. <laughs> and look, it looks like they brought a birthday cake with pink frosting and four little candles. I also found the components of one of my favorite desserts, cupcake. Here's the base. We're gonna put the pink cake with the dark pink sprinkles, white frosting, and the waffle cone topper. Mm -mm, that looks so yummy. And here's a basket, dark pink. Let's see what's inside. A slice of watermelon, how yummy. Lastly, I found this bag of pink beads. Hmm, I wonder what we're supposed to do with these. Maybe it's a piece of the puzzle that will help us find Cupid's arrow. Let's set these aside for now. Let's see what is in the next phase. We have this beautiful shimmery color. What color is it? Silver. That's right. And this phase is filled with silver chocolate kisses. Yummy. I can't wait to see what is inside. Ooh, a slinky. I love slinkies. They're so fun to play with and they make a fun musical sound. Listen. Woohoo! I love that. Next, we have a triangle. It's a musical instrument. Dinner's ready. I also found Kenji. Kenji is a speedy bullet train. Let's put him together. We'll just click this over here and click this one over here. Just like that. Ooh, whoa, he can turn on. Let's make him go. Lastly, I found these fun heart-shaped cutters. Let's set them aside with the beads for now. I'm excited to see what's in our next vase. What color is the shredded paper? Purple. Good job, guys, purple. Listen. I like that sound. Let's see what's inside the purple vase. Guys, there's a purple poppet in the shape of a unicorn. Yeah! Let's see how fast we can pop it. Woohoo! That was fun. I also found two more baskets. And look, they're both purple. Well, what's different about these two baskets? They're purple and light purple. Yes! Let's check out what's inside the baskets. The light one has a yummy donut with purple icing. 
And the dark one has grapes, one of my favorite fruits. So good. There's one more thing in here. Oh, it looks like a purple glitter pen. Hmm. Let's add it to our supplies. And I wonder if we need to make something in order to find Cupid's arrow, huh? Look at this next phase. What color are the items in this phase? Red. That's right. Red is the first color in the rainbow. This phase is filled with Twizzlers and Swedish Fish. Mmm, let's get in there. Oh my, it's Minnie Mouse in a red and white polka dot dress. So pretty. I also found... Little wheel, little wheel, little wheel. Marshall in his fire truck. We also have James, a red train, and a coal car with the number five on it. Let's connect these. Nice. Should we connect them to Kenji? Let's do it. I have Kenji over here. Let's see them go. Thanks for the ride. Look guys, I found another basket, a red one. Let's open it up. Another fruit. It's raspberries. Yummy, yummy. There's another musical instrument. Do you know what these are? Maracas. Woohoo. Lastly, I found some red paint. Let's add it to our basket. We have one more vase. Let's do it. What color are these marshmallows? White! Yes. What is different between these kinds of marshmallows? Some are big and some are small. They're mini marshmallows. Let's see what's inside. We have a cat. What does a cat say? Meow, meow. <laughs> we have a dog. What does a doggy say? Woof, woof. Yeah. Cats and dogs make great pets. Do you have a pet at home? We also have a sheep. What does a sheep say? Ba, ba. And look, we found Olaf. Hmm, what is this? Let's open it to find out. <gasps> it's an egg! Yummy! There's the egg white and the egg yolk. Do you like your eggs hard boiled like this? So I also found a sunny side up egg. Yummy! With egg white and egg yolk right here. How do you like eating your eggs? Sunny side up, hard boiled, scrambled. What do you like? I love eggs. They're such a good source of protein. Hey! Our last items are string or twine. And this bag seems to have some clay inside. Hmm. Let's add them to our little container. Well, we've taken out everything from the vases, but we still haven't found Cupid's arrow. Hmm. Let's try to figure out what we should make with all of these items that we found. Maybe they're like hints to a puzzle, and if we could put it all together, then we'll find Cupid's arrow. So we have our twine, play, some beads, three heart-shaped cookie cutters, purple glitter, red paint. What do you think we should make with everything here? I know, let's try to make a necklace.
cute little necklace. Let's see if our dolly wants to try it on. Wow, so beautiful. What's going on? It's a magic necklace. Is this what's going to help us find Cupid's arrow? Yay, we found it. Good job, dolly. Now we can give the arrow back to Cupid. Now Cupid can spread love everywhere on Valentine's Day. Thank you guys so much for helping us solve the mystery of Cupid's missing arrow. Be sure to tell all the people you love how much you appreciate them on Valentine's Day. And if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more great fun. See you all again so soon. Bye!